What is going on guys? It's your boy Sifty Giver Dude here. Before I start this video, I just want to mention to you guys that I recorded this literally last year. If you guys don't remember, I made a video about me breaking my camera and this was the video of me like kind of like showing you <laughs> Well actually it's and the the the, uh, the title is different, but trust me, this is the video when I accidentally broke my camera. Uh just to let you guys know, this video is gonna be a little bit long, which I really do apologize for, but this is something that I've been doing as a little kid and i really wanted to talk about it with you guys so this video is that exactly just wanted to let you guys know that really quickly and uh, yeah hopefully you guys do enjoy the video and uh yeah keep in mind this was filmed like a year ago so yeah peace what's going on guys it's your boy 70 give it here welcome back to a brand new video for you guys today yes you guys we're back at it again with a brand new video but today's video is actually going to be a little bit different i'm going to try to make this as short as possible um because it is kind of a long story but i do want to tell you guys why i created galaxy warriors now a lot of you guys are probably really new to the channel and don't know what galaxy warriors are as of my og fans though Galaxy Warriors is a series that I did in my channel a long time ago with a couple of my friends that I evolved my Minecraft series with. Basically, what ended up happening was Time Survival, and then after Time Survival, it was Galaxy Warriors, and then it was Time Against War Against Time, and then Heroes of Christmas. A whole bunch of stuff basically happened. Honestly, I'm not gonna lie to you guys, I did that because I actually did it myself when I was a little kid while I was playing with my toys. This video, I'm basically going to be telling you guys the origin story of Galaxy Warriors and why I introduced it to my channel in the first place. This is technically a part one video, a part two will be coming out probably in a couple of days or something. And I'm gonna be explaining what happened to Galaxy Warriors, at least for the Minecraft series that I have in my channel. So I'm gonna actually break this into three sections actually. So the first part I'm gonna talk about is uh, what kind of started it all. When I was little, I used to play with my toys. I used to have socks as characters. Yes, I'm not joking. I used to play with my socks and I would pretend they were characters. I basically created my own universe. Uh, I did a little bit of like a little bit of a Transformers. At the time, uh, I never watched Superman, but it had like a type of origin story like Superman, basically. I, w I lived in a planet called Cybertron, basically. And uh, I can't believe I remember this. And the reason why I remembered this is because like it's something that I did like I continue that storyline for like so many years you know and I'm not gonna lie to you guys I kind of came up with new storylines throughout the years in my head and uh, I kind of write them down I kind of play it out sometimes too please don't judge me but I do kind of write more ideas because of that origin story basically and what ended up happening in the story was that I came from Cybertron, uh, my dad was in Cybertron, basically, and uh, he sent me to another planet because they were getting attacked by this evil dude named Dark Striker. This is a whole, like I said, this is a whole different story of what the Minecraft Galaxy Warriors has come to. But what ended up happening was he sent me to this other planet called Earth, basically, so technically I'm an alien. And once I got into the planet, uh, I met these two friends actually, and they're actually my real life friends that I had in elementary school, which was Verno and Nicholas. I don't know if they watch my videos, but if you guys end up watching this video, you're in my world, guys. <laughs> Hey, I do need to say this. I involve a lot of my real life friends into this world. I literally do like as a when I was little, I used to have my enemies as the people who would bully me before and everything like that. Like there was a guy named Miguel in my elementary school that I kind of didn't like because he used to bully me a lot and he he ended up being one of the villains in my story basically it's kind of crazy to think because like i made so many storylines with uh how this origin came up basically this wasn't even the start of galaxy warriors this was just the start of one person what's kind of cool also about this also uh from moving on from that little uh storyline basically i watch movies and i would literally come back home just to kind of reenact those movies with but with my characters i'm not gonna lie to you guys once i get like a professional camera a professional equipment basically in general i actually want to bring these stuff back 
to in real life and kind of put it on this YouTube channel. That's one thing I would really want to do, honestly. This will be the one thing I would love to do. I'm not joking with you guys. I want to bring this into real life. So one day in the future, I'm going to look back into this video and I'm going to be so happy with myself. Yeah, it's kind of crazy to think, though, that like I based it out that whole thing started with that origin and then like I kind of made it grow as it grew and grew I made new characters I made them collide universes I actually watched crisis on infinite earths and I did my own kind of crisis yeah that's why I say don't ju don't judge me but I do kind of play it out sometimes I do this time though I don't use socks I use rubber bands I use rubber bands I actually don't use all of these but I actually have them like separated like no, uh, I gotta change that name just because I could get copyright because of that. But I do have a group named Triforce that I'm definitely planning to change the name to. Then I just have extra people here. Yeah, basically. As of now, they're in like different like universes at the moment. So about characters, like I made like character lists basically about like who, who's who and everything like that. I've been making random ass names, honestly. Like I said, I kind of just make these names out of people that I know in real life. Honestly, shut up! I make these random ass names, honestly, because of, like I said, just, like, people that I know in real life. Oh my god, these people are gonna fucking annoy me, honestly. Oh! Oh! I just dropped my camera again! The reason why I created Galaxy Warriors, let's head to the straight, to the point. The reason why I created it was because I needed a group name <laughs> for my characters that I've made in my imagination, basically. And I thought of Galaxy Warriors because at the time, uh, during my whole like toy section with my when I was a kid, I literally was traveling through galaxies to help this kind of pandemic that was happening. I don't know. I honestly can't remember why I called it, honestly, Galaxy Warriors. But it was just more of a group name, you know, like the Avengers or Justice League, you know. But I do wanted, I did want to do have a catchy little name, and I thought Galaxy Warriors was a pretty cool name, honestly. Not gonna lie, I created it when I was little, and I didn't know what Guardians of the Galaxy were, because I never heard of Guardians of the Galaxy. But do not worry, it's not a ripoff of Guardians of the Galaxy, I promise you guys. Even though some of the characters actually have powers, the powers that I usually use a lot when I imagine it is mostly like Dragon Ball fights, mostly, mostly that, and also just kind of flash, like being like fast and everything like that. I sometimes use other powers besides those, but I, I will think of something clever once like I actually start doing this in real life. Matter of fact, I do have a lot of stories, but I don't think I'm gonna actually Film all of it, if that makes sense, you know? I mean, it'll be pretty cool to film all of it. I'm down to do all of it. It's just that I think what's going to happen is I'm going to have to think of something, like, shorter. Like, combine two into one, if that makes sense, you know? I don't want to keep this too long, also. So, like, that's why I created Galaxy Warriors, in a way. And to the point, too, about the Minecraft series. The reason why I kind of wanted to interpret Galaxy Warriors into the Minecraft series was because it was the easiest way I can interpret... Interpret, I don't know if that's the word. Interpret, ugh, can't even fucking pronounce it. I wanted it to interpret with my, uh, ser with my Minecraft series because at the time I was doing time survival and that's when I realized that I didn't want to really stick to it too long. We created a little storyline with that. And then that's what led up to my 70s Game World on the original series, basically, which I really do enjoy as of now because of how, like, r not raw, but of how fast-paced the videos are on those episodes. That's when Phase 1 started with the whole, like, Galaxy Warriors and then War Against Time. And then Phase 2 happened with uh, Heroes of Christmas, uh, Dark Warriors, and uh, Age of Destruction. And then Phase 3 started, which was Mind Control, uh, Operation Mind Control, Operation Amnesia, and then Operation Completed. Then the movie came out. After the movie, I planned to do Phase 4, but I canceled Phase 4. There's no more Phase 4, by the way, guys, just to let you guys know. I probably will talk about a little bit about Phase 4, actually, in the future. I think I talked about it once, but I think I'm going to talk about it again, actually, because just to let you guys know, uh, that's going to be canceled. That's why I created Galaxy Warriors and I thought this was a really important video to record. Hope you guys did enjoy the video. If you guys did, hit that like button and subscribe to the channel if you're new. I really do apologize, like I said, that this video is probably long. It's all over the place and you guys don't really understand what's going on. Like I said um, earlier, like it will be so cool 
to look back at this in a couple of years when I have like professional camera and professional equipment in general and just look at this video and just say wow like I said I was gonna do this and I actually did it you know and I'm actually gonna stick by it and uh yeah if you guys enjoyed the video hit that little button subscribe to the channel if you're new peace out guys if you guys enjoy every day make everything else today everyone stay positive be positive you guys already know to have a to have a positive mindset peace